Hello everybody, and welcome to the Treasures in the Toilet podcast. The only podcast where having a potty mouth is a prerequisite. <laughs> that is the best intro. That's pretty fun. <laughs> <funny. laughs> um, I am joined by some lovely gentlemen. I am joined by Ryan over at the High Notoriety Network, also known as Ghostly Gringo. Oh, come on, man. What? What do you want me to I'm say? Not gonna... That's on a hiatus. Yeah, I guess it is. Do you want to... Well, we'll do uh, whoring out in a minute. Okay, fine. Fair <laughs> enough. I'm also joined by CMH777. How you doing, CMH? Why does everybody have to say the 777? Well, they're, fine. They're, I won't say 777. They're very irrelevant I'm... numbers. Fine. Just there. Fine. Fine. <laughs> It's a lot of steps. <laughs> We're here with it CMH. Is. How you doing, CMH? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> and we're here with Pat Shea, also known as Player Two. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? All right. Uh, we'll start off the uh, podcast. We'll go through uh, games we've been playing, then we'll go over news, and then we'll do something fun, probably. That's that usually like the layout of the podcast. That Sounds I've like decided. A good idea. Like it. And this is in a test run, so this is the first episode. So it's gonna be fun. Yeah, don't judge us too much, yes. Yeah, please. Judge. Please judge them all. <laughs> judge them hardcore. Um. So judge them all the way to the bank. Let's uh. Let's, <laughs> what have you guys been playing and doing this week, Ryan? Madden. Madden thirteen. Because I can't afford Madden twenty five. And I don't care what you say, CMH. Man, 13 is still fun. No. I will admit, I still haven't. I play it all the time, so he's no. got a point on that. It's Man, actually fun. They sped, up, they sped up the whole game, plus uh, they made your rookies better, so when you like make a superstar, he's better off right away. And, you know, you it's just, it's just a cleaner type of game. It's not as broken as the old games. Oh. Although they yeah. might have made Man 25 better. Madden 25 is amazing. I've never played a Madden game in my entire life. Man, you are missing I just, out. I'm just not a football fan, so I never got into it. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. I don't know. I love football, so. Yeah. yeah, it's like I haven't bought... I got like Madden 06 and then didn't get another Madden game till Madden 13. And I'm oh, loving God. 13 a lot. <laughs> I heard Madden 06 was probably one of the worst ones. Yeah, I didn't like it. Yeah. <laughs> At least that's what I heard. I've never played it though. It was the first one to introduce the superstar mode, and it was pretty garbage. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. Ryan, Knowing what else that... have you been doing this Go week? Ahead. Well, I've been building up my network that can now partner people. Oh yeah. Hey. Yeah. So if you get eighty views per day and you're not partnered, uh, check out the High Notoriety Network because we can get you partnered. Where can Sponsor. they check it out? www.youtube.com/highnotorietymain all right, wonderful. You can post a link in the. He'll post a link in the description. Yeah, I will. It'll, it'll be the first thing in the description. It'll be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, CMH, what have you been doing this week? Uh, nothing. I've been playing nothing, just nothing. Wow, that sounds uh, terrible. Oh well, uh, I'm waiting till Friday because Friday. Everybody in Europe gets a PS4, so I'll be <gasps> having the people to play with at that point. Yes. Awesome. And besides all the shit that I record for videos anyway, it's like I don't really play much outside of recording anymore. Hmm. Unless I'm playing with friends. Oh, I gotcha. Kind of doing multiplayer right. stuff. Yeah. Gotcha. Nice. All right. Anything else you've been doing? Um, I've been all over fucking the TGN forums and the YouTube gaming forums as well. Fucking setting up collaborations with other YouTubers such as you guys here. And I'm like doing collabs with like a bunch of other YouTubers for the Trophy Hunters Gaming channel. So that's cool. So my name's going to be popping up all over YouTube. Oh, sweet. That's Very pretty cool. cool. Yeah. Yeah. Advertising like a shameless whore. I like it. You're, you're going to be wicked famous, man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Um, Pat, what have you been doing? Um, well, gaming-wise for me, it's just been doing a lot of Call of Duty Ghosts because I'm a Call of Duty fanboy. Even though now, for some reason, I can't seem to actually get a kill. I'm like absolute garbage at the game now, and I hate it. Yeah. I've, 
the game for me is just a big humongous rage machine now. Like, I'm playing this game. Like, I think it was uh, last Monday. Yeah, Monday. I started playing it, and I did four hours of it. I'm pretty sure I broke my controller, and I know I broke my keychain doing it. Because I chucked <laughs> it across the room. I'm like, you motherfucker! How could you do that? I started chucking stuff across the room. but Because I, I wanted to post a bunch of stuff on my channel with Call of Duty Ghosts and just like have like a good gameplay and just talk over it about random nonsense. But I can't get that good gameplay. So now I'm just doing like a weapons guy type deal. Because, yeah, it's like, seems kind of fun for me. I heard Ghosts is like camper friendly and there's terrible spawns. Oh and there's like my awful God. spawns. It is the worst. It's Everybody's not too camping. bad. It's not too bad on PS4 from what I've played. On PS3, it's horrible. Uh, but on Xbox PS4, it's not garbage. Bad. Xbox 360 is garbage. Everybody's <laughs> camping. The spawns, like, you literally spawn in the other person's lap. It's pretty terrible, in my opinion. God. It's probably just due to, like, like maps that aren't designed well. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. They tried, like, making it so, like, I don't really like it. Like, what Infinity War tried doing is, like, they made the maps extremely bigger than any other Call of Duty maps in the whole entire, like, series. And by doing that as well, they got rid of Ground War, which which is the 9 versus 9 mm -hmm. playlist. They got rid Ground of Ground War is in the PS4 version. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, Xbox we, sucks at this point. Yeah, like, what's going on? Well, I guess the next gen is where it's at. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, that actually kind of brings us on to uh, the topic I wanted to talk about today, if you guys are ready. Unless you guys want to talk about more stuff. No, that's fine. About what you've been doing. No, um, I really haven't been. Besides work, that's pretty much it. <laughs> you know. Any, all right. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> so, um, today, since with the releases of both the consoles, I was thinking we'd Compare them. Right, that okay. Sound good? That sounds good. Um, that sounds fine. I don't own either one of them, so... Well, you know what they both look like, right? Sure. Do you know sure, what why not? about? You don't know sure, what they look not? like? Sure, why not? <laughs> Ryan, I'm no, worried dude, about I'm, you. I'm kidding, I do know what they look like. I'm, I'm kidding. worried about you as a gamer. <laughs> you make me sad sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, baby girl. Oh, it's okay, honey. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, sweetheart. <laughs> you got it, sugar plumps. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> all right. Okay, anyway, all right, all right sunflower. <laughs> so, since you guys have both seen them, I know there's a lot of, um, especially when they uh, showed off the Xbox One, got a ton of flack for it. Um, yeah. Well, which one are you guys like visually? Because I'm on the PS4 visually. I just mm. like it better, and I hear the controllers better. Yeah. What do you guys think? Mm. Well, when, when your console looks like a fucking VCR player and is the size <laughs> of a VCR player, it's you so lose big. the points. It's so big. <laughs> it's so massive. It's bigger than the the Xbox 360, the original Wait, look, one. Like, I got the PS4, and I have the PS3 super slim. Yeah. The PS4 uh, okay. is, is actually a little bit smaller or... Arguably the same size as the Super Slim P wow. uh, PlayStation yeah. Three, so it's very They're small. Beating us. We're being we're being passed by Japan at this point. <laughs> Japan's <laughs> like, screw you guys. We got this. Yeah, <laughs> we got this. Yeah, we got this. The sad thing is, is that I agree with you guys in terms of like PS4 looking a lot cooler and looking a lot better than the Xbox One, and yet I mean, probably eighty percent of America is going to buy an Xbox One. Well, yeah, yeah. Xbox One is just the popular one. Exactly. Well, PS4, I mean, Xbox, Xbox just dominates in America, whereas I think PlayStation's more in like Europe and Asia and stuff like that. Yeah, but PS4 sold one million units in America already. Yeah, it's still not that many though, because what? There's like 93 million people in America. Yeah, but then GameStop also no, said no, no, that there's like two point. Yeah, GameStop said there's like 2.3 million still waiting to get one. Yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. Really. Well, the only that's, other that's problem actually, that's actually a good turnout. I mean, you know, I approve of that just because PlayStation looks a lot better than Xbox at this point. Yeah, it is. Well, the, yeah. the other problem with like people ordering PlayStation Four and stuff is uh, Xbox will show higher numbers because even though Xbox hasn't given everybody their Xboxes, 
they still allow pre-ordering of it and ordering really it. but you don't get okay. it until like maybe february right now if you order off like amazon and stuff yeah there's seriously a... it's sold out but you can still get one you can still buy one it's not sold out okay. i thought it was last time i work? saw it was sold out microsoft says it's sold out uh, but all the game stores will tell you we got a few oh okay yeah <laughs> Well, there yeah, you they go. probably gave all You just got to go and out. buy the back and do some favors for them, and they'll give you an Xbox. <laughs> go <to> the back. <laughs> yeah, I'll do you a favor for an Xbox One. You know. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, PlayStation 4, they won't let you, at least on uh, the day one and stuff, you couldn't order one off anywhere. Really? They just shut it off, yeah. whereas Xbox left it on. You just won't get it until, like, February. Jeez, that's a little weird. Yeah. But... It was weird how they did it, but that's just how they were doing it. So I think Xbox is showing higher numbers because they have more people that were able to order. Yeah. Of course, then they got more people calling in because the console was broken. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Um, yeah. uh, It's... uh... I haven't heard a lot of the problems with the Xbox One, but I know with the PlayStation 4, there were a whole bunch of people that were saying that their disk drive wouldn't work. Yeah, and that Uh, looked like screen of death as well, too. No, yeah. the uh, well, the problems with the PS4 was the HDMI port, which wouldn't display properly, and yeah, I think there's been one. like a fix for that at this point. And the disc drive thing, it's actually the disc would just get stuck. But PlayStation has a great workaround for this, where you know the glossy part on the top of the system. Yeah, that yeah, part yeah. actually pops off, oh. like really easy. And then there's a small screw down in there, and if you turn that counterclockwise, it manually uh, takes the disc out. Oh, oh okay. So, so your disc can never be stuck. Oh, that's PS4. cool. I All mean, right, that's the good. disc drive may not work properly, but you know, you, you don't have to. At least you got your game. Yeah. <laughs> the other fix I saw for it is to turn it upside down and bash it on it. Yeah, that was with the Xbox One. It's like just yeah. punch it. It's like, oh, that apparently works. <laughs> <laughs> the Xbox <laughs> One is punch your. <laughs> that's ridiculous. The Xbox One's kind of like a uh, an old Mustang or something like that. It's easy to beat on, and it can take it. I don't see the PS4 being able to do that. It's more like yeah, a I, Ferrari or something, or a yeah. Lamborghini. <laughs> yeah. I punch that thing. Except that it costs less it. than the Xbox One. Yeah. That, yeah, yes. that's that as well. But that's well, mainly because of the... Uh, the Kinect sensor, the right? Connect, yeah. The Kinect is like an extra $100 on top of it. Bullshit. If you make the Kinect mandatory for the system to work, that's not a legitimate reason to... Uh, make people pay more for your console. It really isn't. If yeah. You have to have it. It should be. Yeah. I know. It's a I little. I want to stand in front of a screen and jump around so that they can track my movement. That doesn't sound like fun. Jump around. Jump around. Yeah, especially in the room <laughs> where I am in. Like the ro- my room is completely like really cluttered. So like I couldn't even like use the sensor that well. Yeah. They already even have games for it though. They have like a fighting game. I forget what it's called. Seriously, are are these like arcade games or actual like releases? It's from Ubisoft. Oh god. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. That, that's just a lot right there. It was. <laughs> I bet I can find it really quick. It was. Um... Ubisoft does a lot of crap sports games, so. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they have Killer Instinct, but that's not the one I'm thinking of. Right. It was. Is it even on here on this list? not good enough to be on this list. Ubisoft know, isn't like a, good enough. Yeah, it was like a boxing game. But uh, but hmm. I was thinking about it, I'm like, that sounds like a terrible idea, especially if it's multiplayer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or a really fun it's... idea, I mean, whichever way you look at it. <laughs> no, it's a bad idea in general, <laughs> if it involves a connect. You're like, you yes. want to fight? Here you go. And then you punch your friend out instantaneously. <laughs> I know, it's like, you don't even need to connect to punch out your friend. You could just do that normally. I do that all the time. Why not just get some boxing gloves and some mouth guards out and just beat the piss out of each other? <laughs> I know, that would be a lot cheaper than getting an Xbox One. It would. <laughs> It'd also be a lot more fun. <laughs> yeah, you could say that unless you're the one who's getting this living snot out of you. It hurts so well, bad, stop it. Just become a better <laughs> fighter, you know? Just watch like a Rocky movie or something. So you both get some practice time, and then you beat the shit out of each other. Just watch a Rocky <laughs> movie, then you'll be fine. <laughs> awesome. 
Um, what was the other thing that I was looking at that was crazy? Have you guys heard that it's four? They're both four K compatible. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know if that's true. Um, PlayStation Four technically can't do anything in four K, but it does have the capability. They just need to patch the system to do it. I don't know about the Xbox. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Because I mean, like my my TV screens aren't even able to do four K yet. I don't think there's a <laughs> lot of people who have 4K TVs. Yeah, I mean, they yeah. cost a bundle of money. A bundle. Yeah. But yeah. that's pretty cool that maybe they're uh, actually capable of doing it. But, yeah. yeah. I'm just excited that now games that will be on Xbox and PlayStation 4 that are also on PC will actually be really high quality now. Because they're yeah. going to be hemorrhaging with a 70-year-old system. Yeah, no right. downgrading Battlefield 3. Yeah. They can actually <laughs> go further on now. That's good. Thank you, Next Gen. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, yeah. And uh, hardware-wise, do you guys mm-hmm. know about like any of the hardware or anything like that? I somewhat know about it. A yeah. little bit. Like, like, the, like just a tiny, tiny bit of it, but yeah. Yeah. Because they're both running, um, well, they, yeah, they both have um, eight core AMD, mm-hmm. uh, eighty six CPUs, eight gigabytes right. of RAM, and stuff. But they differ when it comes to which kind of RAM they're using. Like the Xbox is using a DDR three, and the PlayStation Four is using a GDDR five. Yeah, mm-hmm. which means the PS Four is basically. All of its games, with no issue, are going 1080p, 60 frames per second. Exactly. Where, where the Xbox One, it's like, so the games could do that, but the system also has to also compensate for the Kinect always running and the apps that go with that. The, yeah. the ability yeah. to use a snap feature at any point to watch TV while you're playing a game. So it has all that background stuff running, and it's hurting the system itself exactly. for gaming-wise. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Xbox, or uh, Call of Duty Ghosts. On yeah. PlayStation Four, it runs at 1080p, 60 frames per second. They both yeah, run and, at 60 and that's frames. not even a graphical intense game compared to like Battlefield. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and, and on Xbox One, it runs at 720, but it's upscaled to 1080. Upscaled, yeah. Yeah. Well, that that always. It, I mean, I don't think it looks that much different, but at the same time, it's just the sound of it. It's like, what is this going to be like in five years? Yeah, exactly. Right. I mean, if the PlayStation Four is doing better graphically wise than the xbox but here in the u.s xbox being like the bro system and you know the big system yeah Mm -hmm. you know all the games are going to come through that a lot of them anyway exactly Mm -hmm, yeah i don't know i hope xbox will turn out to be good i plan on getting both of them so so i I want xbox to be good because the playstation 4 needs proper competition oh yeah right (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, I don't know, I'm probably, even though that the PS4 is looking like the better console by far as of right now, I'm probably going to still go for the Xbox One just because of launch titles and, and exclusive titles. Yeah, exactly. Oh, you I've guys been... realize that Xbox 4 is a very illogical name for the Xbox. It's probably going to be uh, like the Xbox 72.765. <laughs> I mean, with the logic of the direction they're going in with the names, I mean, it, I wouldn't be surprised. See, I always thought that they were gonna they were gonna do this one, the Xbox like 1080 or something. Right. They'll just yeah. call the next actually, one. But then the next one just be called one. the Xbox. <laughs> They'll just go all the way back to the beginning. We're putting out the original Xbox. <laughs> Xbox regular spelled out. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe they'll yeah, go really. uh, Pokemon style to do Xbox Black and White. <laughs> and then oh, Xbox Y and Z. <laughs> yeah, Xbox Y and Z. <laughs> Xbox Y and Z. <laughs> They'll put out Xbox Z four Q Q Q Batman symbol. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wonder who like who decided to come up with like that name and like the Microsoft like the Microsoft like discussion board is just like, dude, we gotta figure out a name for this console. I've got it. The Xbox One. Dude, <laughs> we got it. We got it. It's perfect. It's perfect. Because it supposedly does yeah. everything. I just really want to know like like what all the other names were for it. I don't oh, know. who knows? It's probably the Xbox Seven Twenty. 
Probably that was one. one. Probably, yeah. The 720p? (laughs) (laughs) They're like, that probably isn't the best marketing when we can get games up to 1080p in almost 4K (laughs) right now. Yeah, exactly. It's just like, eh. (laughs) Eh. By that logic, Xbox 360p would have been a bad name, too. (laughs) (laughs) Guys, I'm going to go take a 360p in the bathroom. (laughs) <laughs> no this scope. is definitely treasures in the toilet i will say oh man <laughs> oh it's the best you know it's the best i think this is the best thing ever made ever <laughs> it's true i'm loving this oh. Love it. <laughs> um how much how long have we been going for not long enough not like 25 minutes yeah 25 yeah <laughs> Jeez. not even close no i'm just kidding <laughs> Um, Firehose, or Pfizer, ugh. What are you Ryan, saying? stop putting things like that in my chat. <laughs> <laughs> You're not allowed to say that in this podcast. <laughs> oh, why not? You're banned from saying that. <laughs> Damn, I want to see it, but for some reason not popping up on mine. Oh, it's personal. Oh, okay. Gotcha. <laughs> it's personal, guys. It's personal. <laughs> it's getting personal now. <laughs> um, things just got a little more intense yeah right <laughs> so i mean i'm i'm personally leading towards the ps4 just, yeah it's nicer it's faster but of course i like i said i'm probably gonna get both the consoles because i really want to play dead rising and i don't see them putting it out on pc for a while don't dead you not even own a console right now though what don't you not own a third gen console or a second or whatever it is I have an Xbox 360. That's about it. Oh, you, you don't do? Have a PS3. Yeah. That's about it, or is it? I have that, and then I have every. I have like my N64, my PlayStation 2, my PlayStation oh. One. Retro, retro, right. retro gaming. Like Jeez. PlayStation Tuesday. <laughs> PlayStation Tuesday. <laughs> That's such a corny name for a series. It's <laughs> the best name for a PlayStation 2 series. <laughs> PlayStation Tuesday. <laughs> It'd be awkward if it took place on a Wednesday. It did today. Oh. If you like miss PlayStation Tuesday and have to move it to Wednesday. Yeah. God dang it. <laughs> Second episode, it's on Wednesday. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, screwed that one up, so. <laughs> oh, God. But yeah, I don't know. Like, the PlayStation 4 obviously is looking, well, to me, is looking better. But due to the fact that I have been a Xbox fanboy since the first Xbox coming out, I'm still gonna get an Xbox One. Probably gonna get it for Christmas if there. I mean, if there's any around. But I'm still doing it because of like games. Like I'm a big Halo fan, so I'm gonna get it for Halo yeah. and things like that. And Titanfall's coming out. It's gonna come out for the PC, but I don't have a PC that can handle it. I'm so I'm gonna go. To that. Yeah. Yeah. I I've already pre-ordered both. De- I pre-ordered Titanfall and I pre-ordered. Destiny, so far. Oh, Destiny. Yeah, the first console I ever had was Xbox as well. Yeah, I mean, if you want to count my Super Nintendo as a console, then I had that. But I mean, the big, like a big console that I spent like almost all my life on was my original Xbox. Yeah. But uh, yeah, see, I'm... the first game I ever owned on that was MLB Slugfest 2003. You guys ever play that? Uh uh-uh. uh. You can literally. Mm-hmm. Slugfest, you could beam people like in the head and in the, and then it, you know, people would catch on fire sometimes. Oh and, yeah, once they caught on fire, they'd be like really badass and they'd start like dominating the game. Oh my god, that's kind of like MLB like, Slugfest played... 2003. It's the funniest game ever. Oh it's like god. the most badass baseball game of all time. <laughs> that sounds like the Bigs. Played... I played the Bigs a lot. The Bigs is not quite as like intense, but the Bigs is probably better in terms of just like mechanics and graphics. Right, yeah. I mean, Slugfest yeah, no, is really good for if you like like the stupid, like the jokes and like you know just the ridiculousness. Right. <laughs> it's like baseball reloaded. Beta? Beta? Baseball reloaded. <laughs> oh, PlayStation Four's got a beta for Destiny. Yeah, yeah. every on co- um, the PS, I think it's a Xbox Three Hundred and Sixty, PS Three, PS Four, and Xbox One all have the. A um, beta release for Destiny. I think, He's the, it. I think the PlayStation gets early beta though. Gets straight. Yeah, they get a little bit. Like maybe they hadn't. They didn't announce like how early they will get it. But 
critics say maybe like a week or something like that. I mean, it's not going to be that that yeah, um, but... drastic, but I mean, people who are recording PS3s are going to be way ahead of the people who record Xboxes, such as myself. Yeah, yeah. like me. I'm going to be putting up stuff for Destiny when that Oh, hits. I can't wait. I can't wait for Destiny. But the only thing is that I'm really confused, because right now, I pre-ordered uh, Destiny for my 360. So right now, because I'm not sure if I was going to get a Xbox One during before they launched the game, but... As of right, my beta release right now is for my 360. If I switch it to an Xbox One, I don't know if I can switch it. Switch my uh, beta release to an Xbox One. I don't know if I could just. I have no idea. Because like don't that's no either. That's a question that I have. I mean, like if worst comes to worst, I'll just play it on my 360. I mean, it's not going to look as pretty as an Xbox One, but wow, it's still the really same game. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry, I'm looking at releases right now. Oh, <laughs> I'm looking at Steam right now, and everything's like fifty to seventy-five percent off. Seriously, now? Yeah, like most of the really good games, anyway. Awesome. I gotta look at that then. It's, it's like the Black Friday Steam type now. Steam sale. Oh my. God. Oh okay. Oh, so is this like the they Christmas do they do Steam sales sale? like around this time? Yeah. November twenty-seventh through December third is the spring sale. Wait, the spring what? Spring the winter sale. sale. Spring sale? That doesn't make any sense. Or autumn sale. Sorry. Honestly, okay. They had it upside down on the bottom of the screen, and it looked like no. It, on the bottom of the screen, it says spring sale. On the top of it, it says autumn sale. You just gotta get your eyes checked. I think that's the problem. I swear to God, if I could show you this right now, that's what it says. <laughs> well, why don't you put a screenshot of it, like on the pot? He'll put a screenshot. Yeah. I'll yeah. Put a screenshot of this, and I'll put it on there. It's like you. You're just as of right now. You just seem crazy. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Why would it say spring sale in like November? I don't know. Do any of you have Steam? <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. going on there now. Go on there. In like yeah, the main page, it. the top of it says autumn sale 2013. Bottom of it, it says spring sale 2013. Oh crap! I have so many tabs open right now. Um, that or my they all, they all the podcasts. Yep, yep. He's right. It's what? Yep. He's right. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> like upside down as well. Yeah, like, the you're bottom not gonna of the screen notice. is upside down. They just like it's so weird, and you can click all the stuff that's on the bottom, but it's all upside down. What? <laughs> Wait, what? This makes no sense. That's amazing. Wait, what? Yeah. What Steam, are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what is oh this? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Who god. Who designed this layout? I don't know, man. It's weird. Probably somebody who was a dummy. <laughs> they just wanted it to be on here on this podcast so everybody could be like, what is going on? <laughs> Holy crap, Skyrim. Hey, it's a nice Steam before. endorsement. Yeah. Steam. <laughs> oh, yeah. Skyrim Ooh. is only seven forty nine right now. Outlast for six seventy nine. Oh, I got. I might take advantage of that. Yeah. I, I, I might take advantage of that. I got some money on my wallet, so I might be doing a lot of these. It's on a verse. You want to buy it for me and I'll pay you back. Outlast? Yeah. Okay, num numero, numero uno. I'm not buying you a Mac game. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, I'll send Terraria? you a PC version. <laughs> you ass. Oh, Terraria? Terraria, <laughs> Terraria is 249 right now. That's good. That's, that's a really, really great price. Yeah. yeah. Especially with the new updates and everything they've done. Oh. Oh yeah, I I haven't looked at them that much, but it seems pretty cool. They overhauled the entire game. I, That's awesome. I am probably gonna have to buy that one. I can get so many games to play on the channel now. <laughs> that you'll never play. <laughs> I know I'll never play. It, I know that. You, I mean, like... you gotta do DCUO and Batman and. Uh, oh, I have so many Purple things Nuts. to do. I need to go back and do uh, Metro Last Light and uh, Call oh, of Duty yeah. still. You need to yeah. do Let's Play Let's Talk, where you Let's Play the Let's Talk. Let's Play the Let's Talk? Yeah. How am I going to do that? It makes sense. If you're yeah. high. Yeah, true. <laughs> anyway. But, um, yeah. I know. I didn't know that you were into uh, Metro Last Light. I'm actually doing... I've been trying to do a series on that. I think I went through, like, nine episodes, I want to say. Game yeah. horrible. I think... You don't you like think it? You don't like it? I fucking got that game day one. Did trophy guides for it. Hated it. Really? Really? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's not that great. Oh, to me, I I like it a lot. Yeah. Is, I mean, environment like, wise, like visuals, it looks decent. 
Yeah. It could be yeah, better. Yeah, I mean, but... like, it's, it's not, like, the it's not the prettiest game, like, out there, but... I know, it's just, like, a really cool game, because, like, to me, it's got, like, that creepy aspect to it. You gotta be all sneaky, yeah, trying but, to get but around corners. Yeah, but my problem is the way but... they marketed it was that it's gonna be, like, Fallout, where you can, like, go around, uh, you can do the missions, you can do the side missions, you can just go wherever you want, but no, the game was linear, go this way. Yeah, it was extremely linear. I mean, yeah, there was for, no, except for like going off the path into like a tunnel, but then you had to go back onto the track again. You could, yeah, but there's yeah. just a collectible over there. I know because I made a video for it. Yeah, <laughs> I got so much shit one time because I was freaking out in that game because of the okay. spiders. And oh yeah, yeah. There was a tunnel I had to go down, and I'm like, ah, not going down there. And then like three people on the comment section were like, "You're a pussy," and I'm like. <laughs> down there <laughs> yeah i will admit like i i've said that a couple times i like see like this dark corridor i'm like nope nope nope, nope. <laughs> not doing that not doing that uh, i've been played through i played through the whole entire game once already and then i'm recording on top of it because i'm doing the hardest difficulty on it and or like the ranger hardcore mode or whatever it's called and no, that's like my play that's what my playthrough, I'm doing it through. Even though I'm pretty sure I know what's going to happen, it still is just like, nope, I don't want to do this again. <laughs> this is too scary. But it's pretty cool. I refuse I mean, to buy the Ranger mode. Oh, uh, my game came with um came with a code to do it. So Yeah, right. same. See, I yeah, got I mine got off Steam like, a little bit afterwards. Oh, okay. And it's like, you have to buy it. And I'm like, nope. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, it's cool, but it's not really... It's... There's, like, DLC for that game now as well. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah, like, yeah that's, that's like, missions that? and things. I don't know. Oh. Sounds interesting. Yeah. But, I don't know, I gotta look into that. I just didn't think that, that um, the difficulty was is worth a $5... Um, oh, excuse me. It's not worth a $5 not. download. No, I no. don't think that you should have to pay for a game mode. Unless yeah. it's like a game breaking game mode, you know, just totally different from the actual game. Well, the game right. developer said that Ranger mode was the way the game was meant to be played, but it's a DLC. Yeah, I just thought that was that ridiculous. Makes sense. <laughs> well, that makes no sense. You have to play it this way. It's the best. Oh, five dollars, thanks. <laughs> yeah, really. But you're gonna have to pay us just because we're that nice. Uh, I know. No. I mean, like, it's kind of a cool concept because, like, literally, you have absolutely no hood. And you have to memorize, like, what the actual controls are. And some of the controls to, like, put on your gas mask is, like, three different button combinations at the same time. Yeah. And for, like, if you see, like, the first episode of mine, I didn't know that um, when you try to go into, like, a menu to select your stuff, it didn't show up. So I was, like, hitting, like, the left bumper, which shows my menu. And I'm just like, why isn't it doing it? I can't put on the mask. And then, like, this... the the girl that you're with is like yelling at me to put on the mask. It's like, I can't. I don't know how. <laughs> the amount <laughs> like, of she's... times I forgot how many <laughs> or where the controls were in that game is yeah. ridiculous. Like, yeah, I, that's what. Yeah. <laughs> I'd just ahead. be in the middle of my playthrough and I'd be like, um, flashlight, flashlight. No, 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 no. How do I turn on the flashlight? Like, no, I don't <laughs> want to change my ammo. Dang it. Yeah. <laughs> I just kept forgetting. I'm like, oh. Yeah. Then I'd have like, to pause and I'd have to cut that bit out. Yeah. Before I figure it out. That's why you like, write all the controls down. I thought about it. I thought about getting like a chart and putting it right in front of the screen while I recorded. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. <great. laughs> like, yeah. That's why I'm kind of a little scared to go back to the game because I completely forgot any of the controls for it. Yeah. All I know is how to shoot and walk forward and maybe <laughs> turn on my little match thing. Oh yeah, I was trying to do like at first I was trying to do the game mode without using my flashlight whatsoever. I was just gonna use like the little um like the fire like the lighter that you get. I was just gonna use that the whole entire game. That didn't work. I died right mm. away. I'm like, okay, now I'm gonna have to use the flashlight now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But yeah. spiders, hate them. Hate them. Yeah, don't like spiders. Don't nope. like I don't like spiders in general. No, me neither. Like, if I see a spider, I'm just like, nope, 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 <laughs> go away, go away. You should have seen how Ryan reacted the other night when he saw a bug. Oh, God. <laughs> Ryan, you there? Yeah, I'm here. You're being so quiet. I'm looking at football statistics. Oh, my oh God. Oh, my God. 
It's okay. The Patriots won. It's all good. <laughs> Ugh, come on. <laughs> Patriots, seriously? <laughs> I'm sorry. I live in Connecticut. What would you expect? <laughs> For you to just hate football. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Sorry about that. But, yeah. I don't know. What's next on the agenda? Uh, um, what's next? Other than that, uh, releases. And then I need to find something funny on Kotaku. Gotcha. Oh, that's always a good sight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, anything like releasing that you guys are looking forward to? Yeah. Uh, PS4 in Europe. I can think of one. <laughs> <laughs> PS4 in Europe. Fair Don't enough. There, but I'm excited for it. Yeah, well. <laughs> I can think of something that's releasing that I'm looking forward to, but I don't think I should say it. Uh, what? Great, Ryan. Great. Great. Thank uh, you for that. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank I you for your please. stiff humor. <laughs> Come on, man. Boo! Shut up. <laughs> Alright. Um... Let me Let's pull see. up the... I'm just trying to make Treasures of the Toilet seem more name-appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> Ridiculous. Next time I'll start it off with we're releasing the Kraken. <laughs> Gone. Alright. I'm just going to pull up a thing for the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One on releases. It's right. like a comparative thing about what they have. I haven't read that yet. But PlayStation 4, in the long run, has a lot of games, it looks like. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds yeah. like fun. But a lot of them are... You can get them on PC if you wanted to. Yeah, you can get them on Steam, but... Yeah, but, but they, they look as good on the PS4. That's the thing. Yeah. Yeah, the P, P, PS4 is pretty groundbreaking for console-wise, anyway. Yeah. Right. Visually and everything. But, um, I don't know. I mean, like, the things that I'm really, I really am interested in on the Xbox One is, like, uh, Dead Rising 3, of course. And, right. Um, was, Quantum Break looked interesting, but I don't know anything about that game. Nobody knows anything about that game. Yeah. So. And then Titanfall. On there. Mm -hmm. But that's going to be on PS, or on PC, so. Yeah. But it won't be on PS4, it doesn't look like. No, it's not coming to PS4, but EA said, like, Titanfall 2 probably will be. Yeah. Okay. Whatever that means. That makes sense. <laughs> it's kind of like what they did with Dead Rising. I think Dead Rising 2 went out on PC, but all the other ones are on Xbox only. Mm-hmm. So that was weird. Yeah, that's a little strange to do it that way. Well, no, PS3... um has Dead Rising 2 and Dead Rising 2 off the record. Okay, so yeah, Dead Rising 2 was on all platforms, whereas all the yeah. other Dead Rising are only on Xbox. Mm -hmm. Great job, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Dicks. <laughs> <laughs> um, but what, what, like, what's PS4 getting? PS4's got Killzone right now, it's getting Infamous. Yeah. I heard Killzone. Uh, heard heard knack is terrible but it's knack oh yeah. uh, we're getting drive club which is like a racing mmo that's gonna be cool yeah it's kind of like you chick you pick a kind of class i guess a vehicle and you race yeah you can people. like create like clans but in a racing game sense it's i don't know yeah yeah like team that's kind of cool that's a cool yeah, that sounds like fun. it'd be interesting yeah that I would mean, be like a fun I'm... like multiplayer one that sounds like a good time yeah, I'm like a, I'm a racing fan. Like I generally play shooter games, but if I see a good racing game, I'll be all over it. God, I haven't played a good racing game in forever, and I will, I will not get the new um, Need for Speed on PC. I well, Sound of and I played a Mario Kart game, didn't we? Yeah, that was that's we a great racing Mario game. Kart. It's so Mario realistic Kart. too. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, everyone throws turtle shells at each other when they're driving. I know, exactly. And um, yeah, of course, if I throw a banana at you, you are going to spin out regardless. regardless. No matter what. Physics. Oh, yeah. Accept it. It's all <laughs> physics, guys. Banana, tire, spun out. <laughs> Case closed. Um, 
what are the other ones? Warframe, that looks kind of interesting. Mm-hmm. That's a free to play game. Yeah. Right. I mean, PS4 has Blacklight. Yeah, it does. Yeah. yeah. That's also my thing. And is it's that... getting Planet Side 2. Yeah, oh, it's yeah, getting that's, Planet Side that's 2. That's going to be pretty cool. Uh, yeah. That's what I'm a little jealous about because Planet Side looks awesome. Like on the P- on the PC, it's awesome. Unfortunately, my computer can't handle it. I don't think reason. any computer can really can really handle Planet Side Two that effectively. Yes, it's difficult. <laughs> like <laughs> I tried nice doing, <laughs> I tried doing it, and literally I couldn't see like two feet in front of me, and I'm just like, and like I had like three frames a second. I was like, oh god, I just want to play this game. It looks so awesome. It does. But I mean, because I was watching. Uh, who is it? If you guys know of Sea Nanners, he did like a little bit of um he did like a couple hour live streams of him playing Planet Side Two and his computer is absolutely fantastic. He could live stream and have this thing running at sixty frames a second. Yeah. Jeez. And I'm pretty sure once you get to like a certain amount of followers on Twitch, they let you live stream in H D. Really? Really? I don't think they originally let you live stream in H D though. No. I, well, only, yeah, I can the understand I've that. I've never seen her in 720. Well, I mean, how many viewers do they got? Us? Well, no, no, wait. Oh. Oh, you mean you mean the ones that you watch? Oh, I don't know. Like, I think it's like averaging 5, like something. I think it's averaging like fifteen hundred a week. Oh, yeah. You see, see, I have twenty followers on Twitch, so they only, they only let me do it in four eighty. Oh, okay. I don't know what mine's in right now. But it's only a picture, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, okay. it's, a sex, it's a sexy picture. Yeah, have you seen Indeed the picture? It is. Treasures I like in it. the toilet. <laughs> I know that's great. I'm actually waiting for um, a really good friend of mine, Cassie. She's doing some art for us for the podcast. Freaking, so freaking awesome. Yeah. Is that, is that the girl that or? you're that, that she the said girl it'll be like thirty dollars? You up with? What? Oh, that's fine then. Which one is the girl that that old lady tried to set you up with? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> that sounds like an person. interesting story. Would you date my daughter? No. <laughs> <laughs> Here's your lotto tickets. Go away. Yeah, really. Please go. I don't want to do this. <laughs> um, are there any other games that you guys are looking forward to? I mean, probably all next year ones, of course. But uh, yeah. Well, Grand Turismo is coming out next week. Damnation oh, yeah. 2. Damnation 2? Yeah, I haven't just seen just anything kidding. on that. Just kidding. <laughs> That's a terrible game series. I don't know. I think I'm going to make that. I'm going to start it off with 2, and then we're going to go back to 1. Oh, man. Oh. And people, the only no, release I'm just... looking forward to is PlayStation Tuesday. PlayStation <laughs> Tuesday. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> oh, God. I think I'm here more for comic relief than anything. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we need that. You need that one guy to do that. Yeah. I mean, we can't all be funny at the same time. Ryan is all the potty humor, the entire time. <laughs> all of it. I haven't been all potty humor. Come on, not all of it. All day, every day. All day, every day, every day. Every day, I get you. Every day, America. Did you guys ever play Plants vs. Zombies? Yeah. I've yeah. heard about like my heart is boring. It's not are you, boring. I, are you gonna play Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare? Oh, what God. the heck is that? <laughs> you got that. kidding me. It's like a Call of Duty style Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> Are you kidding me? No. <laughs> Garden is, this like, is this a spinoff or is it an actual game? It's an actual game. Oh yep. my God. I'm pretty sure it. it's going to be like a, you know, like at least the $45 title or something. Oh my Probably God. a full title. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. <laughs> Here, let me see if I can send you guys a link to it. That's ridiculous. Google and yeah, you'll post you'll post it on the on the description too. The oh, yeah. link to it, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you could check that out as well. Yep. <laughs> do it. That's crazy though. Yeah. I when I first saw, it, I'm like, really, really. <laughs> Plants vs. Zombies: Gorilla War. <laughs> <laughs> I can't keep a straight face with that. No, no. You... I don't think they want you to keep a straight face. Whoops, phone's ringing. Damn it, Gosh Ryan. darn it, what are you doing? You lasted this long. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh, Phone's God. 
Let's see. Birth year? Yeah. Okay, whatever. Alright, there it is. You got it. I got it now. I think. Got what? Alright. Um. Oh, no, wait. Never mind. Just Ryan sending messages. Never mind. Yeah. Copy. And... There you go. There. Yeah. Oh, my God. Plants vs. Mm -hmm. Zombies Garden Warfare. Okay, the phone stopped ringing, so I'm back. Good. All right. 24 mo player multiplayer action, 4 player online co op customization. What the Hell crap? for pre order. <laughs> yep. Birth year is 1902. No, it's not on PlayStation. I tried, I tried making a YouTube account where my birth year was 1864. And then they blocked me because they said that's not a legit age. <laughs> like, why would they offer an option if that's not allowed? They're like, you're not, you're not that old. It just knows. Why would, right? they, why would they give you the option for that if it's not going to allow it anyways? What if you were actually that old and it's like that's not a legit age? Yes, your name is <laughs> Albus Dumbledore. <laughs> <laughs> My God, yeah, I don't know why they have that. I mean, like, obviously, like it, for for days that um. Like websites that offer you like the the day like the month and the day in the beginning before before the year. Like how many people have said that they were born on January first? I don't know. <laughs> like the, immediately, like my go like my go to if people if like even though I'm over eighteen now, obviously it wouldn't even matter. But my go to was always January first, nineteen sixty. They would always put that. For some reason, oh, it's like, yeah, you know, I'm 53. That's fine. <laughs> it's like That's you're fine. a 53 year old gamer. Good on you. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I was watching this one video, and it was people at a uh, PlayStation 4 uh, release, and at the very front of the line, there was like a probably 45, 50 year old guy, and his grandmother with him, and his grandmother was so excited for the PlayStation 4. Amazing, what? like drooling for it. I, was like, I what? want to be that. I wish that was my grandma. <laughs> like that's the best grandma ever. Like, dude, I could totally just like go ahead and play Killzone with my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> grandma, you want to play Killzone? Yeah, I'm gonna whoop yeah, your shit. ass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so many polygons. <laughs> Back in my day, we never had this many. You kids don't know what you have. <laughs> oh god <laughs> I don't um, know I've, I haven't seen like a bunch of old people I've realized that like especially in the Call of Duty uh, side of like side of this I've noticed like a trend of really really young gamers now extremely oh, yeah. young like 6 8 year old gamers just joining a lobby and telling me to fuck off I'm like what? oh yeah yeah like, what is this? Call of Duty is the worst when it comes to that. Because every time you hop into a lobby, there's some kid that's, like, five years old. Yeah, I know. I'm just, like, I, I honestly, well, I don't like it because of just the high, how high-pitched they are. It's just the screechers. I'm like, oh, my God, stop talking, please. Oh, yeah. And in the fact of, like, I tell them, like, your voice is really annoying. Please stop. And they're just like, no, shut the fuck up. I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck are you doing? <laughs> Does your mama listen to that, man? <laughs> oh, like, my God. It's just like, and it's really bad because, well, now these little kids are doing better than me at Call of Duty, and I'm really sad about that. <laughs> this eight-year-old just kicked my ass. <laughs> it's like he, he went 40 and 0. He went That's 40 when it's and time to go to Battlefield. Yeah. <laughs> That's when you rage quit and pop the other disc in. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, I got both, so I can rage anytime. Yeah. Battlefield 4 is fun, except that I just, if I see a tank, I don't know what to do. I just stand still. I'm like, ugh. Run. Yeah, just I'm like run. a deer looking at headlights. I'm like, ugh. <laughs> Nobody so knows what to do when they see a tank, especially if you're a medic. It's like, oh, it's a tank. <laughs> see, I just enjoy Here's a grenade. The fun. Yeah. <laughs> I just enjoy the fun of playing those games. I suck at playing oh, yeah. them. I just I enjoy running around and acting like a fool. And I know with I... guns. That's all I like. <laughs> <laughs> I have no competitiveness I... at all. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to do that. It's just that I just like I don't know a lot of people on the Xbox side that actually play Battlefield Four. So I just go into a lobby by myself. I'm like, uh 
I don't, and I don't really have that much fun with it. But I mean, like, if I if I had like a like a squad of like five people in it, oh, I would have so much fun doing that. Just yeah. being complete idiots, like in helicopters and tanks. Yeah, definitely. Well, definitely do- when I get my Xbox One. Oh yeah, we yeah, can yeah, play. Yeah. But that probably won't be till sometime next year. Yeah, I'm probably gonna get the Xbox One, and then I'm gonna trade in my 360 copy of both. Uh, of both Ghosts and Battlefield 4 and get the Xbox One versions for it. That's even though a good it'll be, idea. Even though it'll probably be like 20 bucks for them, but whatever. Because yeah. like what GameStop has a deal saying that, oh, if you have the 360, you could train it in and you just have to pay 10 more bucks for the one. Yeah, yeah. Which, I, mean, I can understand that. I don't like it, but I can understand it. So like you, the, you do need to pay us a little bit for that. Yeah, it's just like I'm not going to give you like a copy of a new game and you're giving me a copy that we're probably not even going to sell. Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> that's probably, that's, that's why I think that's like, that's reasonable. But I mean, I don't like spending money. I like money. I like money in my pocket. <laughs> I'm just glad Xbox reversed like a whole bunch of their shit. Yeah. That was good on them. No, that's it's the only- still there. Don't, don't believe it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure in like the next six months they're like, oh yeah, we're turning this all back on. No, it's like it's like the Kinect is listening to you all the time because the system never actually turns off. It's always in standby mode because the Kinect is always listening for you to fucking yell Xbox on. Yeah, but you That's don't have ridiculous. to have it on. And then on they're spying that, on you all the time, though. They are spying on you because people are getting banned for the DVR feature, the ability to record gameplay. You could put commentary over it, and people are getting banned for swearing in the commentary. So they're, like, monitoring what? all the bullshit. Yeah. Really? Yeah, not That's even shitting you. That's dumb. <laughs> That's freaking dumb. They're probably they're watching ridiculous. you when you forget to turn off your Kinect, and you're doing other stuff on that television there. Look how small <laughs> his dick is. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that episode of uh, South Park where they're, like, they have the monitors in the bathroom, and the guy's, like, sitting with all the monitors there, and he's, he's doing his thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh god could you imagine like legitimately that happening <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's gonna be people that screw up with the like live streaming the twitch and stuff oh yeah people yeah, that yeah. are new and they will oh, do yeah. the stupidest shit on twitch yeah oh, like yeah. for example when I first started twitch my first live stream I, nobody could see the screen it was just me talking <laughs> And then my friend, and then my friend called my phone, and I was like, "Well, this friend is calling me, but he knows that I'm live streaming right now." And then they text me, they're like, "We can't see the screen." In 19 minutes, in, I was like, "Oh shit, I gotta stop this." Um, well, I'm talking more like people will accidentally just leave it on, and oh. then go to like FAP or something. Oh, <laughs> never done yeah. that. Shame like a- on them. Or that you know, their girlfriend will come over and they'll. They'll start and getting all you frisky and he's just... like, see you guys later, and then they get down and dirty right on Twitch. <laughs> that will be interesting. Have you ever seen that? Because I know that I look up stuff like that and I can't find it. I've seen you some look... videos of that, <laughs> of people that leave their computer Twitch on. That's so they leave weird. Their Twitch that shit goes on. viral in a heartbeat. Oh, it does, instantaneously. There's like this one guy and he, his, he left his Twitch stream on all night after they had done it. And it... <laughs> They cut out, like, the sleeping part in the video, and it shows him yeah. at the end, and he gets up, and he looks at his computer, and he's like, shit, and then it <laughs> shuts off. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> the best ever. Oh, my God. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Whoa, yeah, that's a big mess up. Try telling your girlfriend that. Yeah, um, you know that the thing that we did last night? Yeah, it's it all great. over the internet. <laughs> You're a porn star now, baby. <laughs> Amazing. I'm Don't worry, we have sponsors coming in. <laughs> we got all these sponsors. We'll be set for life. <laughs> all we have to do is screw up again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, are you guys into M- MMOs at all? And I don't think Ryan is. Uh, I, I never really... I don't know if that's anything. What? No. I don't know if that's Team an Fortress. MMO. Team Fortress 2. Oh, that's not, not exactly. MMO. I mean, I'm not into MMOs because nobody's ever really, like, walked me through, like, an MMO. So it's just, like, this is confusing. There's too many lights, things, buttons. I don't know. I'm done. Yeah. yeah there's too many good people that have been doing this for years. I'm like, eh, yeah. <laughs> Although, since you have a PS4, you should check out DCUO since it's free. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. It's been free for, like, ten years on the PS3, and I haven't checked it out. <laughs> you should do it, right? 
<laughs> no, I was actually going to talk about um, Elder Scrolls Online. Yeah, that's oh, a thing. Yeah. Where are you now? I was. <laughs> are you guys interested in that at all? Yeah. I'm interested because it's I'm coming interested. to PS4. Yeah, it's not, it's going to be on all systems. That's yeah. good. That's good to hear. Yeah. Is that Xbox like the sequel to Skyrim? PS4. Kinda. It's the MMO version of Skyrim. Yeah, so, the Elder Scrolls. Can you still Scrolls kill series. dragons with your sword? I'm not sure. There's a lot of monsters you can kill. I want sword. dragons. <laughs> I'm pretty I, sure want some sort of, I would only buy it if it had dragons in it. Yeah, but I don't think you're like the Dova King in this one. You're just a warrior. No, you're just a uh, random guy. Yeah. Well, I mean, just... like, that's that's understandable. Not everybody's going to be the freaking Dova King. <laughs> 200 be million lobby, but... Dova Kings. It's like, yeah. <laughs> That'd be entertaining. They're like, I'm the like, Dova King. So is everyone else. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, it's like, no one cares. <laughs> yeah, it's like, yeah, and I'm the king of the world. Yeah, shut up. Everyone is. Shut up. Everyone doesn't care. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. Yeah, but I'm looking forward to it because it's, it's like that online aspect that I was that I was looking for in Skyrim. Yeah. Skyrim but it really never happened. That. Yeah. That would have made it amazing. Yeah, even if you were be able to like only join a lobby with like three other people, you yeah. could do like so much with that. Oh yeah. I mean, I I can understand why they didn't because like you could be like in a lobby of four people and you guys could be in the four corners of the of the whole entire map and that would cause like the server to crash. Yeah. Yeah. But um like yeah, I can understand that, but it would have been cool. It like really you only would've... could be like a certain distance away from each other. Yeah, or something like that. Like a marker or something, being like you can't go past this part. Or yeah, it's like off the server or something. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, like you only could be in this village if you leave. You might get kicked out, type deal. Yeah. Or like if you leave a village and go like go into like a like a cutscene or something like that, a loading screen. Everybody has to go with you. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, but that would be kind of cool adding that to it. But I mean. Uh, I still had tons and tons of gameplay on Skyrim. I still have it on my Xbox. I bought it for my um, for my computer like over the summer, and I bought like all the DLC for it, and I had a blast with that. I actually kind of prefer the PC version just because you can put mods into it. Yeah, that's yeah. you can get like the HD texture mod, which makes the game look like hundred times yeah. more beautiful. Yeah, more beautiful than it already is. Did you guys and ever take advantage of that one glitch in the game with the uh, that book made of elf skin? Yep, yep. I did yeah. that, and I screwed up my entire game. Really? Because <clears throat> because I was playing it back when like when you went into a dungeon, uh, if you couldn't do it and you left, it would keep it at that difficulty that you went in at that time. Right. And then you go back at a higher difficult or at a higher level, and you could do it. And you just I went. Wipe out. Yeah, I leveled my character like almost all the way up, and I went <laughs> to go take on uh, the dragon. Over, I forget what his name was, the bad dragon. Oh, okay, like the big, like the main bad dragon. Yeah, where you have to fly on the other dragon yeah, and get there. Can't think of his name right now, but yeah, I know what you're talking yeah. about. So I got there, and I'm like really high level. So is everything else. So uh, they just murdered me instantly, and I'm like. All right, well, I guess I'll go level up. I level up again, and I still couldn't do it. I think oh. I leveled my character, like, as high as I possibly could. So and I can not do it. Yeah, I'm like, I can't, Ridiculous. I can't do it. <laughs> so I screwed up my entire game, and I can't complete it now, because I can't get past them. <laughs> wow, that sucks. <laughs> That's a bad day. I need like, to go find a really good companion. Yeah. <laughs> who's beast. <laughs> Lita's not... Lita, yeah, she was like the first one you got. I never really found any more companions beside Lita because I never really went in that into it looking for people. I ran around with, um... I think the... One of the... I, was the elf guy, I think. Or no, it wasn't him. It was oh, the, yeah. um... The cat guy that you get from the, um... The Magic College. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because... <clears throat> Back in the day, he used to be, if you gave him certain things, he was super OP. Oh, really? He just wrecked people. Sheesh. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I never, I I didn't know you could actually have him as a companion. After I, like, beat the, beat the, like, the the school, I kind of just left. 
and realize you can actually like collect them afterwards. I think you had to you had to do his little quest line where he oh, gives you like okay. spells oh, yeah. to do, and every time you use it, it lights you on fire. And oh, he nearly kills you. And then you go back to him, and he's like, "Would you like more?" And you're like, "No, thank you. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> I don't want to die. Yeah, <laughs> please." <laughs> Uh, like you have to use on undead. No, no, I'm not going to. Thank you. No, no, because <laughs> you're just going to light me on fire, you little jerk. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, yeah that's... Releases that are coming out on both of them, there's a lot of really good looking releases, though. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. On all the consoles. I mean, Destiny is going to be on both. Oh, uh, so, so ready for that. So ready for Destiny. Um, Elder Scrolls yeah, Destiny. Online. Um, what's the other one that I was looking at? Titanfall? Uh, Metal Ge- oh. Yeah, ti- or no, Titanfall is only going to be on PC and Xbox. One. Yeah, oh, I didn't realize you were doing, like, all yeah. consoles. Yeah, I'm th- looking at both of them right now. People like, keep forgetting them. about The Division. The Division. That Tom oh. Clancy game. Yeah, that's like, oh, yeah. like an MMO Game's going to be amazing. People keep forgetting about it. That looks oh. actually really good, but I only saw a little bit of it, and then nobody talked about it afterwards. It, it's basically... An MMO after like I thought that was already out, wasn't it? Or is it coming out no, still? No, no, it's coming out. Oh. Yeah, I'm looking it up right now. I don't even think it has a release date. Oh god, it's telling me telling me what my birth date is. January first, nineteen sixty. <laughs> and then you have nope. that dying light game. Oh yeah. Yeah. Which is zombies and parkour. Yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was watching a couple of things on that. That looks kinda cool. It's like Mirror's Edge, but with Zombie yeah, it's the guys who made uh, Dead Island. Yeah. Speaking of oh, Dead Island, Edge. sucks though. Like, I hate Dead Island. Oh yeah, so do I. But it's it might be good. I don't know. It's next. The guy at GameStop convinced me to buy it. Now I want to punch him in the taint. Like seriously, why would you convince <laughs> me to buy this stupid game? All you do is hit zombies with a shovel. Like, what's so <laughs> great about that? It got Game of the Year. No, really? it did it really. Yeah, it gave won something enough to well, get. They, game they of the have year a Game of the Year edition. Doesn't mean it got Game of the Year. Well, it must have won at least one award to get that. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about that because uh, Batman: Arkham Origins is going to get a Game of the Year series, and that's not going to win the Game of the Year. Yeah, unfortunately not. It's just because people had issues with it. I had a the lot multiplayer of multiplayer didn't it. work. The multiplayer, no, the multiplayer is broken. I did an entire video for that, like a forty-five really? minute video of how angry I was that the multiplayer was shit. <laughs> like it had a really great idea. Three on three on two. That was really yeah. That's what I said idea. as well. It's like it, it was a really good idea, but the fact that you needed to have a full fucking lobby. Yeah, the just re- matchmaking was shit. There's so many better matchmaking systems. I mean, I knew it was going to be bad when when I knew that uh, Warner Brothers brought on um a, splash damage. A, yeah, splash damage. The guys who made fucking Brink yeah. just to make the multiplayer. <laughs> yeah, game Dead Island didn't win any Games of the Year awards. Then how did get the Game of the Year edition? They just make it. A game lot of, of games edition. make the Game of the Year edition. Yeah. But you can't just yeah. do that. Yeah, they, they do, though. They, they can't, but they do anyways. They don't give yeah. a shit. They just show no, like, awards on the front of it. They're like, it's the Game of the Year edition. Who said so? Nobody. We Apparently did. the guy at GameStop thinks I'm a fucking idiot, too. <laughs> <laughs> and I might be. Because I actually listened to him. He's just like, ah, oh, yeah, you should buy this really bad game. Okay, this game sucks. He told me it was good. I regret listening to him. You listened to a guy at GameStop. <laughs> That's I remember the thing is, is that I was looking at a game that was more expensive. Then he talked me into buying Dead Island instead. Sheesh. Like, is he trying to lose business at my Wait, what game are you going to get? Time? That's the question. I don't even remember. It was some ridiculous thing. Was it Madden 06? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I have bad no six because I think you made the better decision. No, <laughs> bad no six was fun. Shut up. Every Madden has been fun. Um, so other other releases that are coming out on both systems. I don't know if oh, they're yeah. All- there's a lot of bulls that do releases. What? All right. So <laughs> on both oh, I, I need to I need to I need to offer the toilet humor. Sorry. <laughs> Get out. Right, the- I'm- what? I'm looking up the release date for uh, the division, and all it's given me so far is um, close to the end of 2014. So it should be s- close to the end of 2014. Yeah, I'm thinking. Have we discussed Halo Five November. yet? I wasn't paying attention at one point. What's what? that? Have we discussed Halo Five yet? 
No. Hey, it's not called Halo 5, it's just called Halo. Yeah. Really? Seriously? Yeah. Alright, oh, well, man, when's that coming out? Uh, whenever. <laughs> I'm gonna, t- I'm probably, gonna take Halo. I'm thinking it's probably gonna come out after... Destiny, maybe? I'm pretty sure it's coming out within the next few weeks. <sighs> Is it? No. No, no they, they haven't had anything on it. Yeah, there's like so little on it right now, as far as I know. The only thing I ever saw was at oh. E3 for it, and then that was about it. Mm-hmm. I'm excited for the next gen of Pokemon. <laughs> we already have the next gen of Pokemon. Well, <laughs> next, next gen. Even though I don't even own anything past Pokemon Black and White. I don't own anything since original Pokemon. You mean like Red and Blue? Really? Pokemon yeah. Red and Pokemon Snap. That's all I've ever played. Pokemon Snap. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I, I was Jeez, just, Pokemon yeah. Snap. Oh my god. By the way, you guys realize this podcast is now gone for an hour and 12 minutes. Alright, cool. So then we can start wrapping up here in a minute. Awesome. Yeah. You gotta make the ta- you gotta wrap up and make the tackle. <laughs> is that what they call it these days? Is that sure. what the kids call it? Wrapping I don't know. Do they? the tackle? <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't know. Other games that I'm looking forward to is like um, Thief, but that'll be on PC, I think. Right. Comes out for everything. Um, oh, Wolfenstein. Watch yeah, Wolfenstein. Watch Dogs, The Crew, which is another MMO racing game. Um, one uh, thing that the consoles are both getting is a new updated version of Diablo 3, if people are interested in playing that. Well, it already oh. came out for the PS3 and Xbox. Oh, did it? Now it's... Oh. Now, I, I think they said it's going to be coming to the PS4. Yeah. I don't mm-hmm. know. Is there a Duke, new Duke Nukem game coming out? I don't think they're ever going to make another one of those. Please, like, no. What, what about years. Leisure Suit Larry? No. Well, I oh. think they keep making those, don't they? I thought there was one that came out just a little while ago. I have no idea anymore. <laughs> yeah, Leisure Suit Larry in the Land of the Lounge Lizards. Reloaded. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just keep making them, guys. People buy it. <laughs> I hear yeah. Larry box office bust for my old channel, and that game sucked. <laughs> oh my it, was God. So, it was so bad. Um, Star Wars Battlefront 3 is coming oh, out. Oh, yes. yes. Wasn't Battlefront 2 uh, like Xbox regular? Yep. Yep. This one will be it on both so... of them. Yeah, and this is made by Dice. So Yeah, it's going to yeah. have... That's going to be awesome, game. I think. It's going to be great. That's a really good one looking here in the future. And uh, The Witcher 3, The Hunt. The Wild Hunt. If you ever okay. played a Witcher game. But Never. Witcher games are really fun. They're like kind of skyrim I guess. Sounds like it's a horror. It's open world, and you fight monsters. And you're All right. like With a, your mind or just with like a sword? Swords, and you have like magic powers and stuff because you're a Witcher. You have like, witch powers. Oh, nice. cool. Yeah. It's a really fun like... game. Really great game. Nice. The new one looks exponentially better, so that'll be something cool. people should check out. Awesome. But... More games to spend my money on. Yeah. I'm gonna lo- lose all my money. All right. Well, hello, everybody. <laughs> so that kind of wraps up the podcast, I think. Yeah. Right. Uh, I kind of wanted to do more, but we got really caught up with releases, so that's cool. Yeah. Oh, you know. It was hey, good. Was... Save that other part for the next one. Yes. Yay. <laughs> um, so, Ryan, where can people find you? Um, well, they can find me on High Notoriety Main. So, www.youtube.com slash High Notoriety Main. And if you get 80 views a day or more, um, and you're not already claimed, you can apply for a partnership from us. We'll, we'll most likely partner you. you all, their only requirement is 80 views per day. Also, we are looking for directors on the network. We have three hub channels, uh, RPG, FPS, and sports. They're pretty self-explanatory. And, yeah, I mean, definitely come check us out and, you know, give us a chance and we're going to be good. So there you go. Cool. Uh, cool. CMH, where can people find you and check out all your great content? Oh, you can head on over to the Trophy Hunters Gaming Channel, which if you are a fan of Achievement Hunter, you'll like us a lot more than them because they're shit. And, and what's, the, uh, what's the URL for that for people? In case the YouTube. Blind? The YouTube. The, the YouTubes. The YouTube's. The, the it's YouTube. a channel called Trophy Hunters Gaming. That's all right. Cool. Any <laughs> any place else we can find you? Twitter, Facebook. Oh yeah, Twitter, MySpace. Facebook, Google Plus. Who the heck uses MySpace? <laughs> Match.com. <laughs> Match.com. Yeah. Match. I was gonna yeah, say. Definitely. I was gonna say. Um, Christian Mingle. 
<laughs> I mean, I, I'm definitely leaning more towards blackpeoplemeet.com. Uh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, great. There's now over 10,000 members. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. Uh, Pat, where can people find you? All right, you can find me on the YouTubes. Just type in, it's going to be um, O-W-T-R-E-Y-A-L-P. If you want to know, that's Player 2. Just spell it backwards. That will be my YouTube channel. Also, that is also my Twitter and my Facebook page. So if you want to go check them out, like, follow, subscribe, all that good stuff. So wait, did Player and- 1 already log in? Yeah, I was going to take that one, actually, and it took it. Yeah. Freaking jerks. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you can check me out there, and look forward to meeting all of you. All right. And, uh, all right. of course, you guys, if you're watching this on my channel, you know my channel. You can go to my Twitter, which is uh, twitter.com, Sir Gaming. And, uh, Stay if you haven't watched... Today. Shut up, Brian. Nobody does your outro. <laughs> 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 Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. If you haven't watched this over on Twitch, you can watch this over on Twitch at, uh, twitch.com slash sound and reverse. Twitch TV.com. You should, yeah, twitch TV.com, or twitch.tv, ha- whatever, Hashtag. you got it. I'll put all the links in the description for you guys. <laughs> yeah, there you go. With a whole there bunch you. of other junk that you guys should go check out. You should go check out these three gentlemen. And, uh, yeah, we will see you guys next week.